Tonight, dozens of people continue to figure out what's next after losing everything in an apartment fire over the weekend. That fire started in a common utility room and investigators are looking into reports of someone running away, perhaps setting that fire. ABC 13 reporter Shelly Childers explains one family had to keep their kids home from school because they had no shoes. Several of the buildings here have still been without electricity since this fire on Saturday. And while those residents have lost their food, Families like the Hernandez family have lost everything. It was a massive blaze that started Saturday evening at these low income apartments near Westheimer and Fondren. Today, the families who lived here now starting over with nothing to salvage. The Hernandez family with 11 year old Axel, 8 year old Alan, and 2 year old Alexa fled their unit just in time as it was already filling with smoke. We've lost everything that it, we've worked really hard for. I mean, you know, we come from a really um, poor family and um, we we were just getting there, you know, to the point where, you know, my family has what we have to have and all of that, but now everything has destroyed. The children lost their shoes, clothes, books and toys. Management relocated the family to a different apartment but inside the unit they say is wet it is not a long-term solution now sleeping on a donated air mattress the family has established a gofundme page as they work to start over mom hoping she can move the family out of this apartment complex for good